found them in the ocean. And we did the same thing seven years ago to her husband. I know this guy. He's the leper. He's not my leper. No, he's my leper. Well, we, we, we better call it in. No, 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 no. There's no time. Here she comes. Go on that way. No, no, no. Don't mean this. That way. That way. I don't think so. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Go. in there I think um, so that's what it looks like out there I'll be catching the bus down by the corner 
outside the cafe. Um, but yeah, my left knee is hurting and I gotta ask my chiropractor to check it out. And if she can't find anything wrong, I'll contact orthopedics. Have me on something and it's the left knee that had the surgery on it in 2018. Just hurts this morning and today for some reason. You got fresh water in here. And um, I'm uploading the video right now. It says it'll be done in 10 minutes. And by that time, I will be going out. Yeah, I'm gonna walk slow over there. I the uh, oops by the restaurant bus stop because, like I said, oops, why the door was locked. Like I said, um, my knee hurts. So. All right, and I'm thinking about going to Culver's afterwards and getting. Chicken tenders at five piece with honey mustard sauce, like extra honey mustard sauce. So, yeah. So, I have time to wait out there. I walk really slow, so. I hope she fixes my knee. Like I said, if she can't, I'll uh, go to urgent care tomorrow or something for it. I don't know what's with me here with my phone giving me um, notifications all the time. Could be games. So, I'm mean, gonna turn on my scheduled app now. Okay. I'm wearing this because it looks cold out there. But if it feels warm, I'll uh. I'm wearing my Eeyore hat, um, Eeyore ears, not that. I'm wearing my Eeyore ears. Whatever. Better safe than sorry, I could say, huh? But yeah, it is wet out here. Catch you later, guys. Fucking damn it. I forgot my bus pass in my fucking apartment. They better let me on, otherwise I'll find them $25. They'll have to first me. Not a joke. I need to go to this fucking appointment. It pisses me off when I forget things. God! Otherwise they'll have to call and ask for a later time. I have to show up. I have to. Motherfucker. Better not piss me off. Sorry, guys. When I get pissed, I am pissed. They better let me on. They better. If not, then I'll have to call and say I can't come because I forgot my bus pass and I had to walk home and get it. I'll be a half an hour late. We're an hour late. Better let me on, or otherwise I'm gonna throw a scene. Pisses me off. Huh. All right, Tammy let me on. I told her the issue here. All right, I did not swear at her. <laughs> But man, 
that. How being irresponsible gets you in very, very big trouble. I can't be that irresponsible when I get a job, okay? I really have to remember to grab my wallet next time. All right, so I'm here, so I'll see you later. Yes, I had to take off my jacket. I was starting well, the to roast. Passes, but I love the name Patty. Oh, and I joke and tease everybody. Oh, I love that cat so much. I wish <laughs> I gave birth to her. <laughs> That's awesome. And I already have a name picked for a boy, Raymond, after his great grandfather. Oh, what? Nice. I, pr I promised him that in in, in um, 1998, a March at his funeral. Hi. Um, did you by chance have a re-exam packet that you brought you with? Head into the no. Okay, so it doesn't fill out yet. I got it. No. And I gotta tell you, my left knee hurts for some reason today. So maybe you've got, yeah, I had yeah. surgery on it, like a torn meniscus. And... <laughs> I'm a huge fan of Eeyore. <laughs> huge. I like to build a bear with the build a eeyore with sound in it and it, it'd be like a total of 40 dollars with sound he has cute um things he say on there he oh. sounds so handsome and sweet oh. over the past week how depressed <laughs> garbage truck <laughs> oh my god you guys i'm just really tired all of a sudden Yeah, she said the ligaments in my left knee was uh, not right. So I hope Tammy is still riding the bus. She let me on, as you know. <sighs> I'm just tired. I think I can go home and take a nap, you guys. I hope there isn't a new driver riding today. Just tell me I forgot my wallet at home. We'll see you later. It's like 10, 10 p.m. in the evening. Like, I'm so ready for bed right now. And here it is, my wallet. Silly, silly me. So here it's sat. And I decided to make this. Fettuccine and creamy chicken flavored sauce. Okay. Two tablespoons margin. I need. Alright. I gotta find a pan, like a pot, not a pan. God, am I tired? Holy mackerel. It's not funny on how tired I am. After eating, I'm gonna.
Master to come. Go complaints of traveling bridges. Making rock. It just have a new, huge size. Does smell delicious? Uh, I suppose we could do that to the nipple. Yeah, I mean, what? What? Pumped? The complex. I'm tasting notes of love. A warm good fun. But we do have this school funding initiative to vote on. Ask Snatcher himself. Oh, you have been. I'm not a true redhead. <laughs> yeah. Our guest of honor. Who are you? A proper boy. He's with me, father. You know this creature? He's my friend. What he said is true. Enough. But Winifred, I don't want to see you again. Do you hear me? But he's not Leave a... my house. Now. Oh. Is that you lied about that? serious injuries, including head trauma, and there is still some paranoia and some delusional thinking. No, I'm not paranoid, officer. She just tried to drown me in my pool. <laughs> we were doing some simple physical therapy. I'm not gonna bother you again. Wait. Call my office and make an appointment with my assistant. <gasps> appointment? Thank you, baby girl. You should go. You know, you are. Uh, you have your mother's smile. God, I loved her smile. So why did you always make her cry?
Stuff Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed really soon after this movie is over, guys. I'm pretty tired. It must have rained. The ground looks a little damp or something. So, yeah. I'm gonna have a bowl of Cheerios now. And I'm gonna play a game of bingo and Sherlock and then go to sleep. for bed. God, this zit is so huge. Oh, that's the toothpaste. Ha. And yes, Mom, rules, you know them, right? Don't scare me, Eeyore. Oh, I love him too. Oh. Or your boyfriend, Piglet. Hi, 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 Chuka Kieran. Now I can kiss my baby kitty because I really, really love her too, okay? Just do those things. Don't scare us and hug and kiss my baby kitty. Oh, I'm forgetting to turn on my fan here. I, uh, I'm going to play Sherlock now and get going to sleep. My door is locked. Mm -hmm. Just double check in here. And I'll just shower in the morning or whatever. <clears throat> no.
days on sick leave. Why not be asleep at 5 a.m. if you can? And she just said that she couldn't sleep. I expressed the little bit of empathy that I could there because we were in the same boat. But I also told her that I would appreciate if she could wait until 6 a.m. to make coffee, since I really need this last hour of sleep. Adding a little bit more to why I need sleep is that I have a form of epilepsy that gets really bad when I don't get enough of it. I find myself particularly susceptible to seizures when I don't get at least four hours of sleep. I knew that I would probably get seizures at work now, meaning that this day would be both stressful and potentially dangerous for me, since there's a huge risk that I might fall. with confusion. She looks at me, concern furrowing her brow. You okay, hon? We're in Houston, remember? You work downtown now. Houston. But I could have sworn we lived in Midland, a small town where everyone knew each other's names. This cityscape stretching out before me feels like a dream. As we drive to work, I can't help but stare out the window in disbelief. The city seems to go on forever, bustling with activity at every turn. Gone are the familiar sights of small town life, replaced by like skyscrapers. Was slowly and sneaking up the stairs. I still lay in the bath, making sure the water didn't splash. While I was doing this, I listened, and I wasn't being paranoid. Someone was sneaking up the stairs, very slowly, step by step. I'm laying in the bath, terrified with tears running down my face. The noise had moved from the stairs to the hallway and it was getting closer. Closer until it stopped outside my bathroom door. I froze, no movement, and I even held my breath. I don't know how long this happened, but it felt like hours. I could hear breathing against the door. A light, faint tap on the door. I stayed quiet. Mm-hmm. 